In this video, we will have a look at some of the biggest floating solar farm in the world. A floating solar farm is a type of solar power installation where solar panels are mounted on structures that float on the surface of a body of water. These water bodies can include dams, reservoirs, lakes, ponds, or other man-made or natural water surfaces. The solar panels used in floating solar farms are typically photovoltaic panels which convert sunlight into electricity. The basic concept of a floating solar farm involves deploying solar panels on floating platforms often secured with anchors to prevent drifting. The panels are arranged in rows on the floating structures and the entire system is designed to float on the water. The electrical energy generated by the solar panels is then collected and can be integrated into the local power grid or used for specific purposes. Here are 10 of world biggest solar floating farm in the world. The Canoe Brook Reservoir Floating Solar Farm is owned and operated by New Jersey Resources Clean Energy Ventures, a subsidiary of New Jersey Resources. The project is expected to generate enough clean energy to power about 6,400 homes. The floating solar farm consists of over 14,000 solar panels covering approximately 17 acres of the reservoir. The panels are mounted on a system of anchors and floats that keep them secure and level even in fluctuating water levels. The Canoe Brook Reservoir Floating Solar Farm is a significant step forward in New Jersey's efforts to reduce greenhouse gas emissions and increase the use of renewable energy. The project is also expected to create jobs and stimulate economic growth in the region. The Seimanjim Floating Solar Power Plant is a massive floating solar farm located on the Seimanjim Sea in South Korea. It is the world's largest floating solar farm with a capacity of 2.1 gigawatts. The plant covers over 33 square kilometers of water and consists of over 3 million solar panels. The Seimanjim Floating Solar Power Plant is a major milestone in South Korea's efforts to transition to renewable energy. The plant is expected to generate enough electricity to power over 1 million homes and reduce greenhouse gas emissions by over 1 million tons per year. The plant is also a technological feat, as it is the first of its kind to be built on such a large scale. The engineers who designed the plant had to overcome a number of challenges, such as how to anchor the solar panels to the seabed and how to protect the panels from corrosion. The Seimanjim Floating Solar Power Plant is a shining example of how we can use technology to address the climate crisis. The plant is a testament to the innovation and ingenuity of South Korea's engineers and scientists. It is also a symbol of hope for the future as it shows that we can harness the power of the sun to generate clean, sustainable energy. The Verde Sol LRS plant is the largest floating solar farm in Brazil, with a capacity of 1.2 MWP. It is located on the Lake of the Santa Marta small hydropower plant in the Greio Mogol municipality, Minas Gerais. The project features 3,050 monocrystally, dual glass and thin film photovoltaic panels with 7,600 floats and 60,000 meters of cables covering an area of 11,000 square meters. The plant is expected to generate enough clean electricity to meet the demand of 1250 families under the remote, self-consumption distributed generation model. The floating solar park is owned by the State Association for Environmental and Social Defense and received funding from the Research and Development Program of Brazilian Utility, Cia Energetica de Minas Gerais. The Omkareshwar Dam Floating Solar Farm is a 600 megawatt floating solar farm located on the Omkareshwar Dam Reservoir in Kandwa District, Madhya Pradesh, India. It is the world's second largest floating solar farm after the Seimanjim Floating Solar Power Plant in South Korea. The farm covers over 60 hectares of water and consists of over 1.5 million solar panel. The Omkareshwa Dam Floating Solar Farm was developed by Rewei Ultra Mega Solar Limited, a joint venture between Solar Energy Corporation of India and TPC Limited and Power Grid Corporation of India Limited. The project is expected to generate enough electricity to power over 300,000 homes. The farm is expected to help India meet its renewable energy targets and reduce its reliance on fossil fuels. India has set a goal of generating 450 GW of renewable energy by 2030 and floating solar farms are seen as a key way to achieve this goal. 
The Alkava floating solar power plant is the largest in Europe, located in the Alkava Reservoir in Portugal. It was inaugurated on July 15, 2022, and consists of almost 12,000 photovoltaic panels, occupying 4 hectares, equivalent to around 0.16 of the total area of the Alkiva Reservoir. The plant has an installed power of 5 megawatts and the capacity to produce around 7.5 G per year. The project is considered a pioneering initiative in the development of renewable energies and demonstrates a commitment to innovation and energy transition. The use of floating solar technology and the concept of hybridization, which allows the combination of solar and hydroelectric energy from the Alquiva Dam, are key features of the plant. The Deju Dingjuang Floating Solar Farm is a 320 megawatt floating solar farm located on the Dingzhuang Reservoir in Deju, Shandong Province, China. It covers over 10 square kilometers of water. The Deju Dingzhuang Floating Solar Farm was developed by Huaneng Power International, a major power company in China. The Sairata Floating Solar Power Plant is a 150 MW floating solar farm located on the Sirata Reservoir in West Java, Indonesia. It is the largest floating solar farm in Southeast Asia. The plant was developed by a consortium of Mazda, an Abu Dhabi-based renewable energy company, and PTPN, Indonesia's state-owned electricity utility. The project was inaugurated in November 2023. The plant is expected to generate enough electricity to power over 50,000 homes and reduce greenhouse gas emissions by over 210,000 tons per year. The plant is also expected to create jobs and stimulate economic growth in the region. The Kyoturata Ete Solan LLC floating PV plant is located on the Yamakura Dam Reservoir in Ishihara, Chiba Prefecture, Japan. It is the largest floating solar power plant in Japan with a capacity of 13.7 megawatts. The plant was completed in 2018 and is a joint venture of Kyocera and Tokyo Century Corporation. It consists of 50,904 Kyocera solar modules covering an area of approximately 180,000 square meters. The plant was built to promote large-scale solar projects and to address the challenge of securing land for utility-scale power plants in Japan. It is part of a growing trend of floating solar farms, which are being developed to exploit renewable energy resources in areas with limited land availability. The Sirinthorn Dam Hydro Floating Solar Power Plant, located in the northeastern province of Ubon Ratchathani, Thailand, is touted as the world's largest floating hydro solar farm. It is a hybrid project that can generate electricity from both solar power during the day and hydropower from the existing dam when there is no sunlight or during peak power demand at nighttime. The project has a total capacity of 58.5 W and is spread over an area of 121 hectares, with seven sets of solar panels installed on the water surface, covering less than 1% of the entire reservoir. The power plant is controlled and managed by an energy management system, along with a weather forecaster system to increase the stability of the power system. The electricity generated from the plant has offset 47,000 tons of carbon dioxide emissions a year. The project, developed and owned by the Electricity Generating Authority of Thailand, began commercial operation in September 2020. It is a significant step towards Thailand's goal of carbon neutrality and is also expected to boost tourism in the region. The Tengje Ezevar Floating Solar Farm is a significant renewable energy project located in Singapore. Officially opened on July 14, 2021, it is a 60 megawatt peak floating solar photovoltaic system, making it one of the world's largest inland floating solar PV systems. The solar farm, spanning 45 hectares and comprising 122,000 solar panels spread across 10 solar panel islands, is designed, built, owned and operated by Semcorp Floating Solar Singapore in partnership with the Public Utilities Board. The project is a key step towards Singapore's goal of installing at least 2 gigawatt peak of solar PV capacity by 2030 and contributes to the nation's 100 green waterwork system. The Tengage Reservoir Floating Solar Farm is a pioneering initiative that demonstrates Singapore's commitment to environmental sustainability and the expansion of renewable energy infrastructure.